Hey everybody, Scott here with the Trek Bicycle Store and ABC Bicycles. And today I'm excited to present to you my new favorite e-bike. This is the all new 2022 Electra Cruiser Go. I just, I, I love this bike. We've been waiting for it to come in and it's here. And I'm excited to share you my three reasons why I just am heads over heel in love with this bicycle. So number one, it is super, super simple. Lots of times with e-bikes, I feel like you need a degree in mechanical engineering to figure it out, not this one. For all of my folks looking for simplicity, there's only one gear in the back, just two handbrakes, and then the controller. I can even figure out this controller. You just simply press and hold the button. It turns right on. You press the plus button once, that brings you into your first second or third level of assist. If you want to back down the power, you can also press the minus button. It's that easy. When I'm riding around, usually I'm not trying to race like the spandex clad roadies on this bike. I'm usually just trying to ride around. So I keep it, I, I would think I'd like to keep it in level one because uh, it just has great power and a great ride. Second thing that I love about this bike is that it's a classic look. It's a beach cruiser, so it has nice, smooth, yet wide tires, so it's going to take up a lot of shocks. It has the big, comfy, swoopy handlebars and grips, nice, cushy saddle, and it looks like a retro cruiser. It doesn't look like a newfangled spaceship e-bike. It looks like a bicycle. Even the battery is hard mounted into the frame. Uh, the only thing that you have is this little charger port that's kind of hidden here behind the chain guard so you can charge the bike. But besides that, it looks like a normal bike. It does have some modern things that are cool, like internal cable routing. So it kind of condenses some of those cables to make it a little bit sleeker looking. But yeah, I just love the simplicity of the look. It's just a classic looking beach cruiser. Uh, Third thing that I really love about this bike is that it's a beach cruiser, but it's made of aluminum. I mean, hallelujah, it's made of aluminum. It's relatively light. It's still an e-bike at the end of the day, so it's not gonna be the lightest bike on the entire planet, but I can reasonably lift it up, put it wherever I need to go. It's not that bad for an e-bike. So top three things that I really love about this bike. First off, ridiculously simple. Second thing, Classic aesthetics, classic look, nice and comfortable. Third thing uh, is that it's just really pretty lightweight for, uh, for what it offers. Uh, a fourth thing, kind of a little bonus here that I really like is that it has disc brakes. So this is where they kind of modernize the beach cruiser a little bit. So instead of doing a coaster brake, it has disc brakes. One thing that bike manufacturers do forget is when you're on an e-bike, it's a little bit heavier, you are going faster, so it's nice to stop on a dime. So you have those nice, sturdy mechanical disc brakes. Uh, so those are my, uh, my four things that I love about this bike. A few little tech facts for my nerdy friends. This has a 250 watt hour battery. You can get about 40 miles in range in, in the first mode. Uh, it also has a, a 250 watt battery. Now, it comes in the low bar. We also have it in the high bar here. So two different styles it comes in, a whole array of colors. And if you're looking for a few more speeds, you might want to consider the Townie. The Townie's kind of been our go-to budget e-bike, classic look, super simple, but it has seven speeds. Anyways, this is Scott with the Trek Bike Store and ABC Bicycles. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, please leave it in the comments below or we're a store. Come on in, say hey, take these for a test ride. We are not a museum. You can ride anything here. We would love to see you and just say hey. Anyways, I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day.